What's up everybody? Welcome to the video. My name is Tanvir Ahmed and hey, consider subscribing if you haven't already to see my beautiful face pop up in your newsfeed every single week. Do you overthink everything in your life? Do you ruminate and play over situations that happened, like a broken record? Do you worry about stuff that hasn't even happened yet? Let's just cut the bullshit. I know you do, so keep on watching. Putting an end to rehashing, second guessing, and catastrophic predictions is easier said than done. But with consistent practice, you can limit your negative thinking patterns. And it all starts with number one, notice when you're thinking too much. Awareness is the first step in putting an end to overthinking. So pay attention to the way you think. When you notice yourself replaying events in your mind over and over, or worrying about something that you can't control. Acknowledge that your thoughts aren't productive. Number two, challenge your thoughts. It's easy to get carried away with negative thoughts, but before you conclude that calling in sick is going to get you fired, or that forgetting one deadline is going to cause you to become homeless, acknowledge that your thoughts may be exaggeratedly negative. So learn to recognize and replace thinking errors before they work on you into a complete frenzy. Number three, keep the focus on active problem solving. Dwelling on your problems isn't helpful, but looking for solutions is. Ask yourself what steps you can take to learn from a mistake or avoid future problems. Instead of asking why something happened, ask yourself what you can do about it. Number four, Schedule time for reflection. Stewing on problems for long periods of time isn't productive, but brief reflection can be helpful. Thinking about how you could do things differently or recognizing potential pitfalls to a plan, for example, can help you do better in the future. So, here is what I would suggest. Incorporate 20 minutes of thinking time into your daily schedule. During this time, let yourself worry, ruminate, or mull over whatever you want. Then, when the time is up, move on to something more productive. When you notice yourself overthinking outside of your scheduled time, remind yourself that you're going to worry about it later. Number five, practice mindfulness. It's impossible to rehash yesterday or worry about tomorrow when you're living in the present. Commit to becoming more aware of the here and now. Mindfulness takes practice, like any other skill. But over time, it can decrease overthinking. And number six, change your channel. Telling yourself to stop thinking about something can often backfire. The more you try to avoid the thought from entering your brain, the more likely it is to keep popping up. Hence, busying yourself with an activity is the best way to change the channel. So exercise, engage in conversation on a completely different subject, or get working on a project that will distract your mind from a barrage of negative thoughts. And that's going to do it for this video. Whoa, 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 wait! I forgot to tell you something really important. You are an amazing person and I love you.